As far as new movies this weekend, we've got a couple of good ones for you. Take a look at my Dean's List reviews. This is Grace Allen. Please leave a message. Mom, where are you guys? For some white knuckling fun this weekend, there's the film Missing, the story of a teenage daughter who goes in search of her mom and her new boyfriend who go on vacation to Colombia, but then disappear without a trace. It's a solid effort thanks to the performances by Storm Reid as the daughter and Nia Long as the mom. But what sends Missing over the top is great writing with one plot twist after another that keeps you on the edge of your seat. It's a Dean's List B+. Can I live with you? Your other son, he needs you as well. And you were at work all of the time. Surprisingly not as well done is the very star-studded The Sun. Surprising given the cast that boasts Hugh Jackman, Laura Dern, Anthony Hopkins, Vanessa Kirby, and Zen McGrath. It's a tough-to-watch story about a New York lawyer struggling with his relationship with his 17-year-old son who's bursting with resentment when his parents split up and father remarries. A story overflowing with guilt and blame and resentment. Aside from wondering why anyone would pay money to be brought down like this. There's also the question of a movie that boasts performances that are so overly melodramatic, maybe even miscast. Overall, the many parts of The Sun felt disconnected. It's a Dean's List C-. minus. If we do not forget these men, we forfeit our place in heaven. And while in limited release the past few weeks, this week, Women Talking opens in theaters everywhere. It's the true story about a group of survivors of unending abuse by the men and boys around them in a Mennonite community. Rooney Mara, Claire Foy, Jesse Buckley, Judith Ivey, Ben Wishaw, and Frances McDormand star in this eye-opening, life-affirming film. It's a powerful, eloquent Dean's List B+. And you can always get my weekly movie review you send right to your phones every week by texting the word Dean to 97999 sponsored by Lyric Opera of Chicago's Hansel and Gretel on stage January 25th to February 5th. Get more information at lyricopera.org. That's it, you guys. Right, thanks, thanks, Dean. Dean.